What's going on people? Welcome to another video. I'm walking into the Bass Pro Shops right here. These people getting embarrassed because we're talking on the camera but everybody's looking at us but it doesn't really matter. We're actually on a 24 hour road trip to Minnesota for the national championship and we're stopping by the Bass Pro Shops to pick up some baits for the tournament. Oh, <laughs> this place is different, dude. <laughs> so Sean was saying this is one of the largest Bass Pro Shops, but I don't think it is. We just went over to the Mississippi River. This Bass Pro Shops is kind of different, you know. It's it's one floor. It's not like it's two floors, three floors, four floors. It's just one floor. It's just straight flat. But there's, I mean, that's pretty cool. Bass Pro Shops, something different. So we're gonna we're gonna pick up some baits for nationals. See, we don't have everything. This man's gonna help us out. So uh, I don't know what we're gonna get yet. We're gonna we're gonna look around. First thing we're grabbing some little jig heads. All right, just simple, clean, nothing expensive. First thing. I'm actually very impressed with this. Look at this Bass Pro Shop. It's a little drop shot baits. We got these like pinkish looking ones. We got this natural color. We'll go with that. Oh, the prism, dude. I like uh. That they don't have hologram shad, dude. This one right here, I know that sounds crazy. You get some darker colors because I got some like lighter, lighter pinks and some. I finally, find, I found the, I found it. I finally found the, the brush hogs. All right, I was trying to look for like a baby brush hog in white, and they don't have it. I do. I might just get like a green pumpkin color. I might go with that. I don't know. I, I just have an idea, I have a plan, a plan for something. I just really need white. I ain't gonna lie, this Bass Pro Shops is pretty sick. Like, it's, it's a little different, like it's not like second story like all the other ones, but it's like level and it's huge. I mean, you got aisles and aisles and aisles of soft plastics. You got aisles and aisles and aisles of hard baits. You got everything. They kind of have it set up weird. Like it's not like where they have all the zoom stuff in one aisle. They kind of got, like the one back home is a little different. They got like brush hogs right here. Then the next, aisle, I mean, they got everything else like frogs and stuff like that right here. And then the other aisles will have, you know, zoom trick worms. And then the, it's just kind of weird how they do it, but it's still pretty, pretty sick. What's the difference in this one, though? We are stacked up right here, guys. We got a lot of baits right here. About to go check out, and then I'm gonna show you what all we got. I'll show you what Sean got. I'll do the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. I'm put it under here. You want, these, you want these in separate bags? Yeah, please. We'll, we'll go to the bake shop. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, my God. <laughs> just look. All right, guys. We're just looking at the pro shop today. This man. Thank you so much, brother. Thank you so much, Sean. Thank you so much, man. We got the bags. We got the goods. We ended up spending a little bit more than we were thinking. But me and Sean bought the same amount, so maybe that's good luck or something. What's up, man? I don't know. We we got a lot. We got the money. We got the juice. We're ready for national. The wind's really high. What's up, man? How you doing, bro? How you doing? What's up, bro? I wanted to go through the arc. We gotta get back on that road. I wanted to see the arc. I wanted to see the arc, man. Thank you. No problem, homie. I beat. I beat. Yeah, no problem. No problem, homie. I like that. Stopping to get some gra getting gra stopping to get some gas real quick. You're talking about stopping a lot on a trip like this. It's like 24 hours to Minnesota. It's just insane. We've been stopping so much, but we're gonna fill up real quick, get back on the road after this little Bass Pro Shop stop. Voices in my head scream so loud. Never know what they're talking about. Now I've got you under my skin. I feel this melting. You got my body feeling things even I can't resist. This is the start.
So guys, I'm almost out of gas. We're on this crazy back road trying to go to a gas station. And we pull up and this is what we get. Alrighty, so I guess I don't know what to do now because I wasted my gas coming down this back road and there's not a gas station here. This is what makes the vlogs interesting though, guys. I guess we'll see what happens. So I just took a fat leak, putting the key in the ignition, looked on the navigation. I think we're, I think we got some luck coming right here, boys and girls. I don't think this vlog's gonna be too interesting because we actually found a gas station. You guys don't get to see me struggle on the side of the road and wait for gas. So we're uh, headed to a gas station that's like four miles this way. I got like nothing in my tank, but we're gonna make it happen. I know we can do it because, you know, Team kicking their bass TV, we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it happen. So I'll catch you guys at the gas station. Hold on, let's pause for a minute. You see all these cornfields, man? There's I've never seen so many cornfields in my life. We've been driving for like six, seven miles, just six, seven miles, six, seven hours of straight cornfields. Like I've never seen anything like it, like this in my life. I've, I've been I've never been surrounded by so much corn. In my life. Oh my god, I think we found a gas station, boys and girls. Oh baby, please. Look at this guys. We are just rocking and rolling right here. Oh, thank the Lord. Oh, we were gonna go to another gas station down the street, but we don't even have to because this old air co is open right here, and we're about to chug up and make this bad boy drink, drink some gas. All right guys, so on these back roads, I actually just met a fan at this gas station. What's your name, man? Isaac. Don't be shy, man. On, Isaac Whitaker. There you go. What do you, uh, you bass fish all the time? Yeah. Where are you from? Thank you. Uh, Tell City, Indiana. Oh, I gotcha. Cool, cool, cool. I just wanted to pull out the camera. I told him he came up and met me when I was walking out of the gas station. And you know, it's awesome. Everybody that supports me, like this guy right here, thank you guys so much, that means the world. All right, guys, I just like to take a moment and say thank you guys so much for the support. Everybody that, you know, supports me and my channel. If you guys could, please just smash that like button, leave a comment below, and subscribe if you haven't already. You guys absolutely mean the world to me. You know, I wouldn't be where I'm at without you guys and meeting. I actually met two fans, you know, here at this gas station. And the crazy part is, is we're in the middle of literally absolutely, like, nowhere. And, you know, getting to meet people, you know, all the way across the world is just an amazing feeling and it's just unreal but thank you guys for everything that you guys do to me uh, do for me and for helping me get as far as I came because you know where I'm at today I literally would not be where I'm at today if it wasn't for my friends you know the fans that you guys watching and my family like I just wouldn't I just thank you guys so much on the traveling note I got the push pop on deck all right I got a water bottle on deck and I got the beef jerky on deck the push pops now this is like a like when I was younger, I used to eat these push pops, man. These are the push pops. These are, these are good, man. You, if you haven't had one, you can stop and get you a push pop. They're pretty good, pretty tasty, and pretty pretty cold, you know. We're gonna get on the road. We're probably gonna go get some food here in a minute. Life was great, wouldn't have changed a thing. I had it guys, oh, we just got to our hotel. It is cold here, all right? It says it's like 60 degrees, but I don't get cold, all right? I don't, I literally, I, I just don't get cold. Like, it takes a lot for me to get cold. But I guess it's something with like no humidity here, way up north. And it's pretty, I mean, it ain't like cold, you know what I mean? But it's something different from what I'm feeling, so. But I wanted to end off this video on what I bought from Bass Pro, or what Isaac actually bought us. Big shout out to Isaac uh, from Bass Pro Shops for the National Championship. But this just my baits, I don't have Sean's baits, I don't have everybody else's baits. So this is just the baits that I got from Nationals, all right? So I'm gonna show you a little bit of everything. Okay, outside, so you got the nice little boat view, you got the spotlight coming down, you got a little bit of everything. Let's let this big old truck pass. That's the most obnoxious thing I've ever heard. Please shut it off, don't ruin my video, man. Please shut it off. I'm tired of waiting, I'm bringing this inside. So I guess bringing this out to the boat didn't work too well, but we're gonna make it work right now. All right, so I'm gonna show you guys a little bit of what I got at Bass Pro Shots for the national championship. I thought all these weren't split out for a minute. So there's actually something, so Zoom has been making like drop shot worms, as you guys know. 
Well, this is like a different drop shot worm that they made, and it's actually in a hologram dawn color, which is like, a pink is gonna be so tough. I, I apologize the quality of this right now. But the hologram dawn, it pretty much like a pink, and it has uh, yellow in the middle, and it's got a blue bottom. It's good for drop shots, especially the spotted bass, the smallmouth. You know, it's really good, so it's one thing I got. I'm gonna go through this kind of quick, I did get a lot of stuff. Um, got these little Ned rigs. These are in PB&J colors. Got some Yamamoto Senkos. Got a few PB&J football jigs, 3 8 ounce, by the way. We got uh, some of those Ned Rig hooks. Those are half ounce, one sixth ounce, one, one sixth ounce, my bad. Got us a Mega Bass jerk bait right here, just one. Big shout out to Isaac for buying that bad boy, because that's like a $25 bait. I have a lot of them, but not like the colors that I would need. Got some more Senkos, got some more drop shot worms. Those are both in the Bass Pro Shop series. We got a Magnum Trick Worm by Zoom. And that's a, that's a watermelon uh, watermelon red. Those Magnum Trick Worms, those, those things are sure get them. And we got like these little Kitech baits, except this is the Bass Pro Shops Tournament Series. And this is kind of like a little shag color. It's got, you know, the white on the bottom. It's got like the tannish uh, back on it. You know, great shad imitation. Uh, what else we got in here? What else we got? We got some uh, baby brush hogs and green pumpkin, by the way. We got some more drop shot worms, and those are like more of a natural color. And then we got some jig heads, and that is everything that I got at Bass Pro. So, I kind of wanted to go over that in this video, just kind of show you guys what I got. I wasn't just going to like buy it all and then just not show you guys. You know, that's just the whole deal. Or Isaac buy it all. I, I, I didn't mean to say anything because I didn't buy it, you know what I mean? So, uh, anyways, thank you guys so much for the support. And I'm going to do a quick apology right now. So, you guys seem to be tearing up these vlogs. Well, that's freaking awesome because I enjoy making them. I'm trying to add more of my personality out into the vlogs because I've been tired lately, guys. I've been worn out. I've just been working so much and I've been traveling so much and I've just been, it's just been chaotic, all right? So, I've been trying to boost my energy up in these videos and it's not only making me more hyper, but it's actually like you guys like it more. So, that's, that's the biggest thing. If you guys love it, then I'm going to keep it up. I'm going to keep the energy level high. You know, so it's gonna be good. We have like eight to ten more hours of this drive on this 24 hour drive to uh, Minnesota. So, the national championship is why we're driving here. Um, national championship, we qualified, me and Sean qualified through uh, Bass and got a third place finish uh, out of a three day event on Winyaw Bay. And that was the Southern Regional. If you guys haven't seen that video, be sure to go check it out. But uh, I'd like to say a quick apology. You might not see too many fishing videos uh, as of right now or the past videos I've posted, the past couple of times I've posted. Um, I post three videos a week, Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. And it's just because, you know, I'm traveling, I'm doing this, and I kind of want to take you guys with me. You know, I want you guys to see through my eyes and see everything that I'm seeing and see everything that I'm doing and just do all this stuff. But uh, if you guys could, please smash the thumbs up button. Just smash it, just hit that thumbs up button. Leave a comment below because I always want you guys to comment. I want to start picking fan comments of the video like fan comments of the day kind of kind of type deal and I'll be smashing them up on the screen and I'll give you guys a shout out and I'll say you know whatever I got to say about the comment and just be all cool so be sure to comment below be sure to smack the thumbs up button also be sure to subscribe and hit that little bell so it sends you post notifications but overall thank you guys so much for the support you guys mean the world to me you guys are awesome we're gonna get these videos back up and rolling we're gonna blow up team kicking their bass tv we're gonna take over and i'm so ready for it but thank you guys so much for watching and i'll catch you guys in the next video I think that 24-7 an understatement to my day-to-day -day. If ain't no way, then I'ma make a 